Book Summary by Teddy Bear Storytime The Great Brain by John D. Fitzgerald is the first book in the Great Brain series, first published in 1967. Characters Tom D. Fitzgerald, the Great Brain the protagonist, known for his cleverness and scheming ways. John D. Fitzgerald, Tom's younger brother and the narrator of the story. Papa, their father, a newspaper publisher. Mama, their mother. Swain Fitzgerald, Tom and John's older brother. Basil, a boy with a peg leg who becomes one of Tom's friends. Andy Anderson, a boy who competes with Tom. Parley Benson, a boy who attempts to run away from home. Tenor Murphy, a young girl who is lost in the mountains and saved by Tom. Book Summary The Great Brain at Work The book opens with John introducing his brother Tom as The Great Brain, renowned for his ability to outwit everyone in their small Utah town. The first instance of Tom's cleverness is when he uses his intellect to fix a mechanical machine that the townspeople cannot figure out. Tom then convinces the other kids that he's the only one smart enough to fix it and charges them for his services, showcasing his talent for profit and manipulation. A case of the measles. Tom contracts measles along with his brothers, and this situation serves as a backdrop for a test of Tom's cunning. Even while sick, Tom is scheming ways to make money off his friends by claiming that his family knows the best remedies. John admires Tom's intellect but begins to question whether Tom's methods are always ethical. The Revenge of the Great Brain In this chapter, Tom uses his wits to get back at Andy Anderson, who humiliated him during a baseball game. Tom devises a plan to make Andy look foolish in front of the whole town, showcasing his vengeful and manipulative nature. This chapter emphasizes Tom's pride and his inability to let go of a grudge. The Great Brain's First Defeat This chapter introduces Basil, a boy with a peg leg who feels ostracized by the other children. Tom bets that he can teach Basil to climb a tree, and he manages to do so, but Basil realizes that Tom is exploiting him for a bet. This is one of the first times Tom faces a moral setback, as Basil's hurt feelings make him reconsider his actions. The Great Brain and Parley's Adventure Tom's intelligence is put to the test when Parley Benson, a boy in their town, runs away from home. Tom tracks Parley down and convinces him to return home, saving him from potential danger. Tom is celebrated as a hero, but his motives are questioned as he charges Parley a fee for the rescue. Tenor Murphy's Ordeal Tom and his friends find out that Tenor Murphy, a girl from their town, is lost in the mountains. Using his problem-solving skills, Tom helps organize a search party, and they eventually find her. This chapter demonstrates that although Tom's primary motivation is often personal gain, he can still act with genuine heroism. Tom's Code of Honor As the story progresses, Tom's schemes become more sophisticated, and he begins to understand that his actions have consequences. He starts to wrestle with his own code of ethics, especially after witnessing the emotional reactions of his friends when they feel betrayed by his manipulations. Themes Cleverness and Intelligence Tom, the great brain, is defined by his cleverness. His ability to outwit adults and children alike is the central theme. The novel showcases how intelligence can be both a gift and a tool for manipulation. Ethics and Morality Throughout the book, Tom's schemes challenge readers to think about the ethical implications of his actions. Is it right to take advantage of others, even if you can? This theme plays a significant role as Tom begins to reflect on the consequences of his manipulations. Sibling Dynamics The relationship between Tom and John is a central focus. John looks up to Tom but also struggles with the ethical dilemmas posed by Tom's actions. The sibling bond is strengthened by their adventures, though John often questions whether Tom's methods are justified. Heroism versus Selfishness Many of Tom's heroic actions, such as saving Parley or finding Tenor, are motivated by a desire for personal gain or recognition. The book explores whether true heroism can exist if the actions are performed for selfish reasons. Life in Small Town America 
Set in late 19th century Utah, the novel provides a glimpse into rural life at the time. The community is tightly knit, and everyone knows each other, which magnifies the impact of Tom's schemes. Analysis Moral complexity, Tom's intelligence often blurs the line between right and wrong. He uses his wit for personal gain, but his actions make readers think about ethics and fairness. Character development, over the course of the book, Tom begins to show signs of moral growth, learning from his mistakes, particularly after hurting Basil and questioning his own methods. Role of family, Tom's family plays a significant role in shaping his behavior. His father, in particular, emphasizes the importance of education and intelligence, while his siblings help him navigate moral dilemmas. Social commentary, the book subtly critiques the idea of intelligence being used solely for personal gain. Tom's cleverness is admired, but it also leads to isolation when his friends feel used. Humor and satire, the novel is filled with humor, largely deriving from Tom's outrageous schemes. However, the humor often serves as a vehicle for exploring deeper themes such as morality and justice. Conclusion The Great Brain by John D. Fitzgerald is a delightful and humorous exploration of intelligence, morality, and growing up in late 19th century America. Through the eyes of John, readers witness the cleverness of his older brother Tom, who uses his wits for personal gain and recognition. The book offers a series of vignettes that highlight Tom's adventures, each showcasing his genius, but also prompting questions about ethical behavior and the consequences of manipulation. At its core, The Great Brain is about the complexities of growing up, sibling dynamics, and the tension between intelligence and morality. Tom's journey is one of self-discovery, as he begins to realize that his actions have real consequences for the people around him. The novel strikes a balance between humor and reflection, making it both an entertaining and thought-provoking read. The End Love the book summary. Subscribe Teddy Bear's Storytime YouTube channel now. Like the video. Turn on the notifications. And leave your comments. See you in next book.